Hey guys, today I'm doing a upper body workout for you guys. I'm just on my way to the gym with my cameraman. I'm going to do just a full upper body workout. So a bunch of different exercises for different parts, like a bit of back, a bit of biceps, a bit of everything. You guys always ask me what I do after my workout as well, like what protein shakes I have, how I have it, or that kind of stuff. So I'm also gonna show you what I do when I get home. Okay, first I'm going to do straight arm pull down. For a warm up, I'm going to do three sets of 12 to 15 reps. Make sure with each exercise that you're doing a difficult weight. You'll know that it's a good weight if you can only do the prescribed reps. You shouldn't be able to do any more than that. If you feel like you could do a lot more reps, then you should put the weight up heavier. So now I'm doing the seated table row. This targets your back. And I'm going to be doing three sets of 12 to 15 reps again. a huge rest in between because what I like to do is I like to get my heart right up and I like to break a sweat when I do these workouts for more of a calorie burn as well. Bicep curls, I'm doing these with a barbell, not dumbbells, and I'm going to do three sets to failure. So I'm going to do three sets um, each set until I can't do it anymore. Now I'm doing a tricep push down with the stroke. I'm doing three sets of 12 breaths again. some ab exercises. The first one I'm going to do is really good for after you've had a baby for your transverse abdominis. I'm doing um, ankle tap. And you just have to make sure you really like hold in your stomach, your tense your stomach the entire time. I'm doing 30 repetitions for three sets. Pumped knee crunches. For me, especially since I've had a baby, you really need to make sure that you hold in your core and if your stomach pushes out at all, then you shouldn't do the exercise. Next, I'm doing toe taps with alternating legs for 20 reps and 3 sets. is the workout done. Now I'm going to have my post-workout protein shake. I use the... <laughs> Be quiet. I use women's best whey protein. And my favorite flavor is definitely cookies and cream. But I also, I switch between the women's best slim body shake and the whey protein. But I do prefer the whey protein the most. I have it in a shake with water straight after I train. This is to help your muscles recover faster and help them grow bigger because your muscles need protein, a lot of protein. I first add two scoops. And some people like to have it with milk or things like that. And for my post-workout shake, I just have it with water. If I'm having it in the morning, I'll sometimes have like a smoothie where I'll put like almond milk, some berries, some oats and stuff like that and blend that together. But for post-workout, I just have two scoops with water.
So yeah, I drink that whole shake. And then after that, I'll probably eat a meal like within the next half an hour or so. I usually eat like chicken and veggies or something like that because it's really, really important to have um, enough protein to help your muscles recover and rebuild. The reason I have a shake as well as a meal after is because a protein shake is absorbed a lot quicker. I'll put a link in my description if you guys want to know where to buy it. It's from Women's Best. I've been using it for months now and I love it. I have lots of different flavors. This one is definitely my favorite, cookies and cream. But chocolate is also one of my favorites. Anyway, that is my workout today. Thanks for watching.